Uh oh! I uh, I ran, I ran out of money. I, I totally ran out of money. Oh, there goes thirteen dollars cash flow. It costs fifty to build a new brick. So I've kind of picked the wrong cell block thing, especially with these luxurious shells I'm building with the shower heads and everything. Yeah, to try and calm down these guys down, it may have cost me all the money. So I'm going to have to start tightening a few little uh, strings here and there. Like, oh dear. Oh, that's a lot of money lost. Oh, good grief. I suppose there's some sort of building thing there. Oh, good. We get a little bit of money for days without incident. And federal grant or a prisoner grant. I assume we get a bigger prisoner grant the more prisoners that we have. Kind of hoping that comes in at midnight and not gradually throughout the day. I think... I think it just comes in gradually throughout the day, which is why I've just got a little bit of money instead of in one big lump sum. So I'm kind of hoping at midnight, as the clock hits midnight, we get something. But I'm not entirely hopeful that we will. Oh shit, no, we just get it throughout the day. Oh my god, I get $13 cash flow every hour. Um, right, well I can build one more thing. So what I'm thinking is we let some prisoners in. And I know that's kind of a risk because I just delete the holding cell. But I don't think they're going to be too angry if I just leave them hanging out here. And we just accept that money of letting things in. Waiting for funds was a terrible idea and I never should have done it. And I definitely need a new capacity because that thing's about to explode. It's not going. I just need one more... If I, if I can host one more prison, I could sell this prison and then do better the next time. Which is literally my plan right now. Actually, can we get money? Is there a way we can actually just get, like, a bank load? Bank load. <laughs> load, not bank load. Just a bank load? Just a load of bank. Um, I'll take... No, I don't need that. I want to go bring it up to 50. So, if I run my current prisons up to 50, what do I get in the morning? 13,800. Okay, so that's not good. Um, what if we open it up to... Maximum security prisoners. Well, let's get rid of the minimum security prisoners and max out just the medium security ones to get a bit more money. Right, how does that give me now if I got rid of 50 prisoners? That gives us 15,000. 15,000 is a good amount of money, but they literally have nowhere to go and I'd have to hold 30 people in a room that currently doesn't exist because uh, I made a dissertation. Now, I can very quickly dismantle those. I don't have a way of getting money to buy new tables. And I'll just say that's a holding cell. They'll put people in it and then I can add the bits they need. But they'll be pissed off. They'll be angry people and I'll have to spend that money very fast. But unless I can get a lot... Current bank loan, zero! How do I current bank loan? Unlock my accountant. Fuck. Ah, oh, shit, I bet it's a bureaucracy thing that I just need to pay money for. Where's my accountant? Finance, land expansion, extra grant, bank loan. Bollocks, bollocks. 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 500. I need 500 dollars. Well, okay. What we could do is we could let in, like, one prisoner. Who I just abandoned. <laughs> yeah, if I let in one prisoner who I just abandoned and then get a bank loan. 500. And uh, what would that give me? Oh, hang on. Intake. Yeah. Uh, field of 21. 500 dollars. You know? Okay, no, you're right. I'm going to build a holding cell and invite a few in. I think 15,000 should be enough to finish that off. At least that top half. And then we could just build a big wall and have a do at the bottom and they could do this bottom half separately. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah! No. Um, I... <laughs> oh. See, in two days I get a nice big blob of money. That's it, man. Maybe in the morning it's like, hey, this is the time when the thing happens. I could fire a few members of staff to try and bring that money up a little bit. But who do I take out? Some guards? There's three guards that are resting here right now. Alright, well, you're sacked. You're sacked. You're sacked. There we go. 22 instead of 13. Okay, that's much nicer. It's not great. I can only build, like, a wall and a tiny bit of a wall. we got those two bits. At least nobody's going to escape if we build the parking through the door. But they need that door to build the fucking thing. Gotta get my cash flow. I need more prisoners in this prison. This can support 96 people. I'm assuming that is absolutely fine. We can always expand this area. Just need that big boost of people. Oh, but I think we need bank loans. 
So I'm going to get one person in. That's the risk I'm going to take for this turn. I'm going to bring one person in. I've got no holding cell for them. I mean, I could make that a holding cell. Like, that could just be a little pathetic holding cell that probably wouldn't be big enough. But it is a holding cell, and it does give them somewhere to go. Uh, it says it's, like, that room's going to fail, but maybe they'll get stuck in there. Christ, I don't know. That'll have to do for now. I've got no rest. We can go. Don't want to stick them in their cupboard. I've got spare offices, but they're not big enough. I could make that the thing, but that's just in a place where I don't really want people. So, we're going to get the one person in, and then we're going to get ourselves a bank loan to finish that thing off. I think that's the best way around of doing that. Until then, I can't do fuck all, so I'm going to put the arcade game back for something to do. Actually, I've got a few things that I've already got that I could start plonking into place. Like spare toilets and shower heads and things. Actually, I could probably build a place for just that one guy. There's just a big open door there, so I don't really want to let him in here yet. Plus, it's completely walled off. Um, I could build a shop front if I wanted to build a shop. I can sell an object! Oh, shit, how do you do that? Can I sell things that are stored? What's, what are all these things? Oh, it says on there. Can I sell that bunk bed? Sell the bunk bed. It's going to work. Can I sell it? Follow, dump, search, search, yeah, what now? Not going to be a thing. Alright, deliveries. Alright, yeah, I know. Two hours until that dude turns up. Everyone's going to start waking up now. And then... We panic, uh, hang on, objects, and then, where's the arcade machine? Look, I'm zoomed in, where's the arcade? Is it in all of them? Arcade cabinet! I'll tell you what, I'm going to give it to the staff members instead. Ha 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 ha! But it's free, so fuck it. Oh, it's not free, but I've already got it sitting there. 175. I see, look, there you go, that's my recent transactions, just cash flow comes in. Right, everyone's up, everyone starts to shower the way they want to do. The arcade machine. I thought it would animate a little bit. I don't know why. People tend to always put more effort into arcade machines than they do any other part of the game. Which is weird. That dude is patrolling. And why is he not letting them through? Oh, they're just tired. Oh shit, today's also the first day of our new uh, way of feeding and doing everyone. So, this is going to be interesting. Run, scoot your way through there. Uh, some people go straight to visitation. This is eat time. Oh, they're not, that's not a prisoner. I just thought that was a prisoner. Due to the way his neck was off centre. There we go. Oh, they, they can turn up during eat time. That holding cell uh, isn't going to work. Is our new prisoner coming in? That's just a supply truck. Where's our new prisoner? Oh, there he is. He's just sitting there. There are no free cells for this prisoner. That holding cell literally doesn't work. Okay. So, kind of guess that would be the case. Because you have to build it up proper. Could make it into a cell. Just a big one that lots of people walk through every now and then. Like, if I made that into a cell and then just stuck. Can I afford it? I've got my spare bed. I don't. Oh, hang on, I got $700! Oh, because I got the guy. Yeah, oh shit, hang on. Tell you what, let's not do that. Let's. Do the bank loan! 500. So that's, say, 12 hours. Uh, oh, shit. I've got to keep this guy for 12 hours without the ability to build anything. Now my prisons are too much. Oh, shit. Okay. What's the cheapest material that isn't fence? Uh, oh, I've got concrete walls and brick walls. Like, walls are going to be just too much. I'm going to make that into a cell. So, this is going to become a cell for that guy. Uh, all we need in the cell is a bed and a toilet. Now, we've got a free toilet. So, making sure we put the toilet in the right place. We've got, uh, we've got a toilet. So, there's this thingy there. And then we'll stick a bed in there. And there we go. There's a cell. That's where that guy's going to live. The guy's just going to live next to visitation. Because, because why not? What's your name? A.I. Ron, Pierre Tech Johnson, Crime 6, Counter Breaking Enter, 2 Counts of Car Theft, Assault on Crocodile Dundee, Dealing Heroin, Sealing Man's Hat, and. Act Hang on a second, he's only been done for burglary, perjury, and manslaughter. Huh. Well, that's a shame. Uh, this cell should be free momentarily to let him through, so we just need to have some guys doing some stuff. You guys are complaining about family. Rec you can't complain about recreation when you're recreating. That's just not fair. 
on me. I'm doing a lovely job of holding you up. That cell is done! He will be taken to that cell. Okay, oh. And he's going to be locked in for a while because the prick tried to smuggle contraband. Why would you do that? Scissors. And a knife. Jesus Christ, he bicycles. I found a knife over there. Good. Okay, status effect. Be suppressed. Good. Everything's quite calm and cool in this place. That's good, I think. I think we have another gate there. We could have a guard that just opens both of them. Maybe have the same thing on the exit. So, I'm just trying to save everybody's time, really. So, unlike this series, where I like to absorb as much time as possible. Uh, the... <laughs> That's what I like to do. We have, literally, to wait for a bank loan. It's a shit, nine hours. I mean, I just got to sit here for nine hours. At this point, it really is like nothing I can do. I could probably... I now See, now I'm at the point where I can sell the prison. For 110,000. My starting grant was 50, so that means next time I'll be on a much bigger thing. You know, that's tempting to do, and then I get a lot more money to start again, and then I can sort of undo a lot of the mistakes that I made. I feel like I made a lot of mistakes with this one, and then I can... Do you get the grants on the next one? I genuinely don't remember. I've only redone this once or twice. I love the idea of it. I mean, I can sell shares. Well, you may be sure I can sell shares and get myself a whole chunk of money. But there's an effort to that. Like, then you have to buy them back and it costs money. So that's kind of a bit of a loan and you just don't own it as much. Plus, if I wanted to sell it, should we sell it? Is that, is that, is that okay? I mean, that's just going to build and it's going to be the same and I haven't quite designed it how I want it to be. But I could just sell it. I could just... That's one of my favorite things about this game. And I could do it, like, how about six episodes in? And how many episodes we are in now? I could just sell it. I'm going to sell my prison. Sell! Yeah, great. Create a new prison. We'll do large. We'll do the same as last time. Weather and temperature. Didn't really see what weather and temperature did. I like that ward and it was nice. So we've got a fog of war, no forest, no lakes, buildings, failure conditions, gangs, events, weather, temperature, limited funds, enable tools. And funds, we're going to start... With that many. Oh, I've clicked here. I hope they come along with me. 110,000! Okay. Okay, good. Start the 140,000. I believe we still get the grants. Okay, so we've got to get all the usual things. Marvellous. And we start again. Right, this time, let's do completely different build. Largely different build. We start again. Fuck it. This is exciting. This is new. Um, I want all the things I was getting wrong last time, I want to get right this time. So... Uh, first things first is I kind of like the way that a lot of the things that I have are set out. So I like the... I like that being in the middle of it. Actually, should we just build it, like, way up high and just build some ad mini buildings and bollocks there and then just have, like, gulags and shit <laughs> with bits in the middle? Might be fun, actually. If that delivery is, like, right at the top and we build it from the top. I've never done that. Should we do that? Yeah, I think we can do that. So the delivery section is going to be a lot more vertical. And it's going to have a wall. Can we build? Oh, we can't build up that high. Okay, but we can build along here. I'm assuming we can build along here. With the, uh... Because I'm going to want to have my locks and stuff. So delivery section is going to be up there. Boom, you're up there. Oh, everything's changed. Oh, everything's changed. Delivery section is going to be up there. The garbage is also going to be, like, right... Actually, do we want the garbage higher? No, garbage is also going to be up there and next to it. Yeah, garbage is going to be up here and next to it like that. It's going to be that big. We're going to have a big storage room here, I've decided. So, uh, where's storage? Storage room. Big storage room here. Like that. I mean, that, none of that's there yet. But that's... I mean, I could just build that and then just move everything that we need. Uh, so, we'll have a wall that runs across there like that. A wall that comes down here like that. A wall that comes down here like that. I feel like the series is going to end when I overshoot and end up killing everyone. Which was very close then. And then we have that goes across there like that, and that goes across there like that, and that goes down there like that. So this is going to become the prison entrance, the lockdown entrance that we've, uh, that I've got quite good at now is going to be here. Oh, do I want it to come all the way out? Actually, no, let's have that little gap so people can walk along the pavement, and then we'll just have that one locked off. So then we'll have the door here. Visitation. What are we doing about visitation? Okay, let's think this through. So this will be storage. Kitchens and bollocks will go over there. This can all be walled for now, foundation later to save a bit of time. So there's no anything. Uh, 
Storage, garbage, deliveries. I mean, the deliveries just all get pumped in there. That's where the new people will turn up, and then they'll be dragged in here, and it's right at the very top, which I think is useful. Right, visitation. People come in, they want to they wanna visitate. And then we need the offices. The offices don't actually need to be near the entrance, I just do it for convenience sake. Holding cells are nice to have early on, so maybe you have to come through holding cells. So we have a complete bulk off there of some holding cells. We'll do a nice uh, 11 by 11. 11's a horrible number. Do I want to get nicer numbers on this? What are you currently sitting at? You're 9. Would you want to go up to 10 to be slightly neater? So you actually go up to a 10 by 18. That's a nice set of numbers. 10 by 18 will be that. The, gar the garbage can stay the same. It can stay small. Um, storage can be... So what's that currently? 16 by 12. That's quite a nice set of numbers. So this can then be a 12 by 12 like that. Shake the thingy up there. So you have to come through the holding cell. Holding cell be a thing that people go through. No, it won't. We're going to have an extension on the corridor. So this is going to be a holding cell. Uh, storage, they're not going to be able to access these walls. It can always, this can always be a second set of doors. And then a second set of doors here. So you come into the holding cell like that. And it's just... Buh, buh. And then if you want to ah, well, if you want to come in this way. We want to... Well, we can always have the visitation room. Sort of sitting down here like this. So we have a visitation room that's quite big. Just here like... That? I want to keep a, a, a corridor down here so I can build off. So I can get offices and stuff down here on this side. This can be the visitation room. With like say a top up here. How do people get into this? Well, I was kind of hoping that the... Ah, well, well, then we have the split down the middle that way. So then the door... Uh, oh, that's three along. Oh, we don't want that to be three along. We want that to be nice for along like that. What size are you? Are you a nice size? 14 by 12. I'll take 14 by 12. It's a nice size for it. And then we have... So the, you go through a staff door there, but into a main door. And the prisoners are coming that side. We can have, like, the dividing line down the middle on a section here or something. I don't fucking know. We could have a... Uh... I think this is just more for me, having it that way. But if we have a section like that with a wall that isn't actually a wall... Hang on, one, two, one, two, one, two... Oh, we can get three along there. Well, let's bring the whole thing down one. That's what this is the... This is, this is why this is the planning stage. That's why I paused the game. <laughs> so I paused the game now. So we're going to have... Right, so we're going to have a gap thing where the person sits will sit here so that's one of them that's two of them that's three of them that's what i would know i want to ah we can have a little door going to it so one of them two of them three of them four of them and so we want a wall that goes along there like that and a door there okay so that's one section of it and then one two down and then over over over, over like that so that'll be a door whoops a door there so this is the holding cells up here garbage delivery storage kitchen canteen we'll get to this is the visitation room. It's still locked behind two. Kind of want to make that a... Uh... That could be a big... We could have just lock, lock a dude in there to open it for everyone and have like this as a... Well, that could be... I'll tell you what that could be. That could be a staff room place in there. And then you have to come through these doors here. So we have one person guarding this bit, one person guarding that bit. Well, do we need that to be locked off? Does that in its storage room need to come down here? Or can this expand a little bit straight away? Or could this be used as something else? Uh... I don't know. I feel like I'm overlocking this place down. I like having the visitation-y thing here. Which we don't need to build yet. Holding cell, do need to build. And then, you know, it can come out here to start with. So then, right, we've got the storage room up here. We're going to need a kitchen. Uh, I loved how we did the kitchen last time. I really loved it now. We can sort of simplify that idea with a bit of a corridor. So we could have something like, like uh, that to that. Instead of having that wall there. To loot the walls. Thank you. So we have the little dude who stands in there. Oh, I like the bins in there as well. So he can stand by the bins all day. So we have just little standard doors. Uh, do I really want the top? Do I want it more middle-ish? Or bottom? Well, the deliveries are going to be right there. So they're going to be. They're not going to be going round anymore. It means that anything we build here, they'll be coming round for. But it's not going to be like going round both ways. So... Little doors here and here, but we're going to have double doors here before we get into the canteen. And no people are going to go in the kitchens just yet. So that ticks in there like that. So this is going to become our uh, kitchen. Nope, because our kitchen's going to be... This is a kitchen. This is the canteen. 
kitchen. So we've got the one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Again, it's going to have loads of room. I don't think I need to build as many as I had last time. And then we can have some sinks and shit along the bottom. Loads of room in there. Nice big sort of area for them. Uh, this could become a small something room later on. There's no uh, need for it right now, but just a small extra room. Oh, it's one of those page things. Notebook page! Good! That's how things work. I have to get all them. One year. There we go. Just checking for any more. Uh, okay, we need... I don't want to go for cells yet. I think this... Actually, the cells should start down here. I oh, know. Office blocks. Office, 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 office. How many did we have last time? We had... Actually, we can... Oh, we need to see it. We need that. Had eight, and I wasn't using all of them, but I think eight was a good number. So if we come down like that, and then it was a one, two, three, four, and then that was there, and then one, two for the corridor, and then I like going slightly for the corridors. One, two, three, four. Fits absolutely perfectly. One, two, three, four. Across. Across. So that'd be one. We'll have all of them fitting in here like this. Uh, one, two, three, four. Like that. I think actually at this point we should have a corridor that cuts through here. So have a corridor that cuts through there and then becomes this corridor here. And then we finish these off. Well, one, two, three, four, boom. One, two, three, four, boom. And then over and then up. Yes. Like that. And then doors, 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 doors. Uh, do we want that corridor to keep going down? Yes, we do do because this is going to be that new morgue exit so, so this is this is more about what i wanted the idea to look like i think yeah so this is going to be uh the medical center the morgue and is there anything else that we need it's holding cells cells we're doing solitary we can do dormitories i'm ignoring canteen kitchen we've got shower we'll need at the start but i don't really think so oh we just need it for that thing don't we yeah that could be like a mini shower to start us off with uh, storage, deliveries, we need power, we'll get it, uh, offices, visitation, common room, staff room, that's what we can have down here, so staff room, common room, esports, exports, <laughs> exports can sit down here, it's sort of free floaty, uh, right, so, 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 we need a staff room that comes across here. Maybe that doesn't need to be oops, as far as that thinks it does for now. We can have a staff room that sits there. Uh, we could then have... Oh, a common room that sits there. And then a staff room that sits here. What was the other one that I said? Staff room, common room, offices are all being done, esports, chapel, parole, parole. We'll do that later. And reception, where your prisoners are taken the first time they arrive. Oh, you can get a reception? Oh man, that seems like a thing we should have. Like just sort of, you know, just a plonk down here sort of thing. And then visitation would be a much shorter, weirder building. But yeah, I'm alright with that. So, just have a set of things like that. With a door. I like the idea of a door and a door out. I'll never use it, but I like the idea of it. And then walls there. And then these guys come through a door here. That door vanishes. So, into reception. I feel that reception's too big. Um, yeah, because we want to have sort of grids of something. Let's shrink that up. It's, it's, the reception's going to be quite small. So, reception there. We'll have that. We've done that to be too far. A door there. So, this is visitation. With its sidey bits and then the other bits. Uh, oh, yeah. Probably, actually, what that's good for is then we could make that look really good by having that there. And then we have the table visitation bits there. Nice! So, thingy visitation, this visitation, reception, holding cell, office, 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 office. Uh, that is staff room. So that connects up nice. No, that's not all staff room, is it? That can be, oops, staff room here. Common room, staff room, and then this can be infirmary slash morgue. And that could stick its ass out a little bit there like that. I mean, I will probably change these plans as I go, but you know. So we've got infirmary, we've got a morgue. The morgue then has the nice double doors that lead out. Double doors lead out there, double doors lead out there. Uh, the doors are locked that side, so I don't really need anything else. This is the 
staff room. This is the staff room. Oh, this is the staff room. We need a door like that. This is the common room, so that's going to have a nice big set of doors there. Uh, this is going to be holding cells, so they're at the top, because we let you in at the top. If we want to lock it down here, we people aren't really going to come in this way, are they? No, so we can get a double lock there. In fact, do we need that lock? No, I'm going to get rid of that lock. So that's the double, oh, that's quite a big gap to cover. Oh, that's okay, and then morgue, and then thingy, so single door there, but then double wall there. Oop, double object there, I mean. Let's try and, oh, I tried that last time, try and keep that thing in there. Okay, objects. Boom, biddy, boom, biddy, boom. Now, don't want to go in visitation. You guys can go in there. We can have just sort of a free floating office. Do we want just a free floating set of offices like that? Just sitting there, doing their thing? No, I don't need that. I kind of want to have a door. We only really need it. We only need the other. Oh, we'll build. We'll build. Fuck, we'll build them anyway. Uh, okay, so that's kitchen canteen. We'll have that maybe as a small sandwich just while we're getting shed up. Yard can be this sort of area here, so we're going to need a wall for nail that comes down like that. And then over there like that. And that's everything that we need. Oh, cells. Yeah, so we need to build some cells at some point. So I figure if we do them in blocks of 10 like we had them, we could then sort of just have those blocks absolutely everywhere. Now we can put the drain on the shower so we can redesign those. If that works, I need to test that. But we can redesign those. We're getting... Oh, the clock's turned on again. We, we really need to start building some foundations, actually. So all we want this to be out. Basically, we want this to be outside. We want all of this bit to be inside. How much will it be? Hang on, if we pause it. For foundations of... Well, just to estimate the entire thing. Half my money. Well, that's not so bad, actually. I thought it was going to be much worse than that. Oh, and I want to... Shit, while well, I'm planning it. Another wall that goes across there like that, so then I can have there as my exports, which will have to be exported through the morgue, but I suppose they're kind of an export. And then we have the rest of the wall that sits on there like that, but just have a basic fence for that, another thingy gate there. Exports here, which staff members can bring in... It looks like it's a long way around for staff. We could always have a, a locked gate here. Well, that's only one locked gate. I refuse. Because otherwise it's outside there like that. Um... Well, they've got a long walk ahead of themselves. So if we have our exports... That's still... No, that's not a... That's just where the exports are. And you have to bring them all the way down to the bottom and then run all the way back up. Which seems really inefficient. So how do we fix that? We build a big wall there and we lock that wall and that. Oh, I'm not a big fan of that idea. Do we want a room for exports up here? Maybe we have garbage down there. I Actually, fuck it. We don't, we're not going to need exports for a while. They just run them down there like that. But we'll put them inside. So that's all inside stuff to start with. Yes. So what we need to do is we need to get the foundation of brick and do that there. Oh, one, no, one off like that. And then that there. And that is step one of prison two. The Nerd Cube! The Nerd Cube!